Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Drizzleland. And this is the Batman Returns episode. Um, so... <coughs> excuse me. Um, one of the most important things about this movie is... This was really a great movie in the sense that you had a great cast. You had Michelle Pfeiffer as Catwoman, which she looked really, really good as Catwoman. I mean, she looked damn good in, Cat, in her Catwoman outfit in this movie. Um, let's be realistic. Batman is... Uh, a legendary character. Michael Keaton playing Batman in Batman Returns is great because he just went right on from his first original role right into this. Um, obviously a few years after that, but still. Um, Christopher Walken as the main villain um, who tries to kill her. Um, He's great as the villain. Um, I've never seen him play a better character. Um, and Danny DeVito is the jo is uh, you know Penguin. I think really was pretty good. Honestly, this is a different role for him too. Um, but I think the storyline is great. The movie, the uh, action. Uh, Tim Burton did a great great job with this movie um i still don't understand why this movie was on like one of the worst uh movies ever made list uh i just don't get that i, I don't agree with that one bit um this was one of my favorite movies um in the batman trilogy um the storyline was great the soundtrack is pretty good too um so let's give batman returns the credit that it deserves um, this was a shining achievement for Batman movies. Um, I definitely think it's better than any of the newer Batman movies. Um, because this really showed the dark side of what Batman was originally. It wasn't puppy dogs and rainbows and all this other garbage that, you know, they try to throw at people with the cartoons, you know, of Batman. Um... This went more into detail about what Batman it was really about, which is fighting the psychotic villains of Gotham. Um, so, this is a movie that I give a, I give ten stars. Honestly, this is a great movie, you guys, um, especially for a movie from 1993. Um, so let's give the credit where it is for this movie I think it was a shining achievement in Tim Burton's career um, as you know he went on to great other movies such as Sleepy Hollow Nightmare on, on uh, Nightmare Before Christmas um, his involvement with Sleepy Hollow um, I mean all the other movies he was involved in I can't name all of them but this this movie is good on its own um, so long live Batman, Batman Returns, greatest movie um, in the Batman trilogy, if you want my honest opinion. So.